So now, let me show you what we do with the high side refrigerant. What we do up top is turn off our refrigerant. And we can either leave the hose hooked up to our can or we can hook it up onto the port here. So but either way, so it's got a seal on it. On our high side, you want to wear gloves. And these are quick connects. You always want to use quick connects when you're using refrigerant. It cuts off the flow at the hose right away and, and uh, makes it faster, helps prevent frostbite. Um, also important to wear gloves. Again, I might be repeating myself, but it's important here. Anyway, I'm gonna pop it off and you'll hear it pop. And a good reason to wear your safety glasses also. Yeah, hear that? Anyway, making sure our cap's in there. We're gonna seal that off. Nice and finger tight. As finger tight as you can get it. Okay, that's good. Okay, so now we've got all this refrigerant trapped in the line and our quick connect has cut it off as you saw. What we need to do is drag this over into the system. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open our line here and we're just gonna meter it in. So it's letting the refrigerant come up and over and down into the low side. We'll listen to the compressor and if it starts suffering at all, then we'll just close the line back off. Okay, and we'll just let it bleed over little by little. And I can even feel the refrigerant here. My finger, the line gets nice and cold as, as the refrigerant's being drawn over. And we'll watch for our, our PSI to equalize. Uh, once that's showing equal, Then we know that we're ready. Oh, and you gotta open the other, you gotta open the low side also. <laughs> Sorry. So now you can see how they're starting to, uh, to drag over. So once our pressures show equal, then we know that we're ready. So now we're drawing all, all that refrigerant over, and we're ready there. So we can shut off the high side, shut off the low side, and now we're ready to disconnect our low side hose. Same thing, wear gloves, use a quick connect, listen for anything funky here. We're good there. Straighter valve with our O-ring in the top. Finger tight as tight as we can get. And if you have to use a tool, only go a quarter turn past tight. And a quarter turn is just a quarter turn. But you really don't need to use a tool. You can always check these with some soap bubbles or an electronic leak detector. Verify that they're not leaking. Okay, now we're gonna wanna attach our hose up top. Our can of refrigerant. Everything's off there. There we go. And down at the bottom, we're gonna avoid trapping any refrigerant in the lines. So we'll go ahead and let it on out. It's a de minimis release. And we're good to go.
Mm-hmm.